So when we come to explaining the seasons, we call it the autumn, storms, rain, we call it in our brain different diseases. But in fact it's the same. A new position in respect to the sun, to the soul, gives us different condition and environment. So is the same with the soul of the man. And what energies we can, what strength fields we can allow, what conditions we create with our systems around the brain of the man, will dictate how man will look, how man will be in a coming time, in a coming process, in reality of totality of the existence. Then, when you move this soul, when you move this central energy to another position, then an in interaction of itself with the soul of physicality of itself will create a condition that the soul of physicality in the interaction with the soul of the man and the environment will give man a new shape. Where at all time, the emotion of the soul of physicality and the emotion of the soul of the man in interacting with each other, being in balance with each other, dictates the manifestation of the perfect physical life at any position in you. Now we see, there is no difference between the man and the planet which created it, and the star which created the whole structure of the environment, and the galaxy and the universe. They're all the same. Different winds, different flaws, what we see on Earth, we call it the winter storms. We open to space, we have magnetic storms, we have to understand the condition of the universe. Where is the winter time? Because even our own galaxy is not in the right angle with its center, with our central force fields of the universe. So it has its seasons. Our galaxy has its own condition and environment, and the storms and everything else. What is in macro? is in micro. It's for man to understand, it's for man to gather the intellect, understanding of if man can manage to handle the storms with his own brain, with his own structure, his own physicality, man can handle everything else in the universe. Because the brain of the man is one of the most complicated systems, but in fact all connected to the operation of the soul within the center of it. Do you battle in different positions, or do you handle the strength of the center that the position is becoming relevant because you adjust to it? The fields adjust themselves to it. You don't need to do anything. Fighting takes time, fighting takes energy. But if you can be with it, go with it, create the condition of the field flow with it, you'll survive. There is no difference in the operation of the brain of the man. The stones we create as rages, as joy, as laughter, as cry, and then the rain, the thunder, the beautiful sunshine, weather, the deserts, the valleys, and the rest. Our scientists have not understood, have not realized the bigger picture which is in front of you. In our brain, we carry half of the sphere. Instability is guaranteed, unless we understand how to operate, how to run, how to manage this champ in the center. 